Heavenly Father, I want to take the time out to pray for all the people in Mozambique that recently had a big cyclone, Father God, in their city, in the nation of Africa. Father God, in Mozambique and all cities surrounding Mozambique that was affected by this uh, cyclone storm and overflood, Father God. I pray, Father God, and lift up the people of Mozambique and all cities surrounding Mozambique and Africa, Father God, that have been affected and targeted by this um, cyclone storm that happened recently a week ago, around a little bit over a week ago, Father God. And I ask that you will cover all the people in Mozambique, Father God, with the blood of Jesus Christ, from the crown of their heads to the soles of their feet, with the blood of Jesus Christ. In Jesus Christ's name, I ask, Heavenly Father. I ask, Father God, that you will cover all the people, every man, woman, boy, and girl in Mozambique, and all the people in Africa, Father God, in the cities, surrounding cities, where the storm cyclone uh, has hit, Father God, their spirits, souls, and bodies, and their lives, Father God, and their personalities, and souls, and wills, and intellects, brains, Father God, their health, their lives, Father God, their testosterones, Father God, their temperaments, and moods, Father God, emotions and feelings with the blood of Jesus Christ in Jesus Christ's name. I ask, Father, that you will cover the people that survive in Mozambique and all other surrounding cities where the cyclone has hit over a week ago, Father God, with your complete full hedge and shield of protection. Heavenly Father God, covered with the blood of Jesus Christ over the people of Mozambique and all other surrounding cities that has been targeted with the cyclone. Father God, in the overfloods, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. Father God, I ask that you will send your angels to guard and protect the people in Africa, in the nation of Africa, in Mozambique, and all cities surrounding Mozambique, Father God, that has been affected by the cyclone, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, in the overfloods of the waters, Heavenly Father, in Jesus Christ's name, that your angels will guard and protect the ones, Father God, that are homeless, Father God, in Mozambique, and all the citizens there, Father God, and all the ones that have gotten injured behind this storm, Father God, of things flying away, flying upon them, Father God, or they getting trapped or stuck and debris of things, Father God, or houses or cars or whatever, and water or whatever, in Jesus Christ's name, Father God. I pray in Jesus Christ's name, Father God, that you will love on the people in Mozambique, on all the survivors there, Father God, and that you will heal their hearts from any trauma, Father God, based on the cyclone and of losses and deaths and and trauma around them, Father God, and dramatic situations around them, Father God, and the losses of their homes and cars and businesses, Father God, and possessions and loved ones, pets, all losses, Father God, and that you will restore everything that the devil has stolen from them, Father God, through the cyclone storm, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. I pray that you will put upon the hearts of the people in Mozambique, Father God, to repent for anything in the nation, in their city, Father God, and in the nation of Africa, where they need to repent anything that they have done to offend you, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, to repent and turn away from their wicked ways for the things that they need to repent for, Father God, in the nation of Africa, Father God and also in the surrounding cities of Africa and in Mozambique and all other cities that has been affected. Not saying that this storm has been caused behind sin, Father God, but Father God, I just pray, Father God, every nation needs to repent, Father God, because we all have sinned and came short of your glory. And I just really pray, Father God, even though there are evil doers that are releasing um, 
this storm, Father God, through climate control. Father God, the climate controllers, I pray that you will deal with these climate controllers that is doing this, Father God, to Africa and to Mozambique and all cities and that you release your judgments and vengeance upon these uh, climate controllers and compel their hearts to repent for the wickedness of destroying people off their lands to steal their lands and to injure people and to kill people Father God and cause them to be in financial duress and cause them to be injured and sick or whatever, Father God, and trapped and stuck, just causing so much havoc upon people in Mozambique, Father God, and putting them in a very dire situation, in a very duress situation, Father God, bringing so much duress upon the people in Mozambique, Father God, that you will not allow these uh, climate controllers to get away with doing this type of disaster attack unjust wicked unrighteous thing to innocent people in Mozambique Father God in Jesus Christ's name I pray Heavenly Father that you will release your correcting fires and convictions upon the climate controllers Father God that is causing all this natural disaster to happen everywhere in the world in Mozambique Africa in America, in every nation, in every city and country, Father God, all over the world, in Jesus Christ's name, to bring these evil climate controllers to repentance, Father God. And if they do not repent, I pray that you release your judgment and vengeance upon these climate controllers for killing innocent people and destroying your creation and your earth and your people that you have created, Father God, innocent people and souls that you have created, Father God, because you are the divine creator of everything and you have created everyone and everything on this earth, Father God. And so, Father God, you have created the wonderful people in Mozambique as well and you created Africa and Mozambique and all cities in Africa, Father God. Every precious soul in Mozambique, including the animals as well. So, Father God, I just pray that you will just bring justice and liberty to the people in Mozambique, Father God, in Africa and all other surrounding cities where this cyclone storm has hit, Father God, because these storms are not without a cause, but you know the cause of it, Father God, whether it's through climate controllers, but we understand, Father God, you and I understand that the devil is definitely behind it in the spiritual realm, in demonic forces, is behind these cyclones in the spiritual realm of things, and that's causing and that's operating through evil doors evil human agents of Satan um, releasing these cyclones and climate control issues Father God upon cities and nations and countries and upon Mozambique Father God in Jesus Christ's name to put people in Mozambique in a tough situation where they can't get food, they can't get supplies, they couldn't walk and they just walk in in very deep water, Father God. So I just really pray in Jesus Christ's name that you'll rescue them, that you will send the right people to rescue them and that you'll provide everything that all the people in Mozambique need and food and safe shelter some kind of way and that you will guide and direct them and give them wisdom, Father God, where to go and and help that you will send your angels and to aid the people in Mozambique and all the surrounding cities that got affected with the cyclone storm over a week ago, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, and that you'll provide them with the food and the water and the finances and the medical supplies and needs, and that you'll supply them with your love and surround them with your love and peace and kindness and favor and mercy, Father God, and that you will comfort the people in Mozambique on every side, Father God, with your comforting hand, with your comforts, Father God, and that you will send your comforting angels to comfort the people in Mozambique that are hurting for losing their homes and cars and businesses and finances and loved ones and possessions and just security and autonomy, Father God. 
In Jesus Christ's name, Father God. So I just pray, Father God, that you will restore everything that the devil has stolen from them and that you would just console the people in Mozambique and all the surrounding cities that have gotten targeted with the cyclone storm, Father God, and that you will dry up the waters and the grounds, Father God, speedily and miraculously, Father God and clear up the roads in uh, Mozambique and all the other cities surrounded that got hit by this uh, cyclone storm, Father God, and that you'll restore the land and the properties and the homes as well, Father God, and the businesses for the people in Mozambique, Father God, and all the surrounding cities that got affected by the cyclone storm. I ask Heavenly Father God, in Jesus Christ, saying you, Father God, are the God of restoration and you are the God that do miracles. And you're in the miracle working business, Father God. So I thank you for releasing your miraculous power and your grace and your mercy and favor upon the people of Mozambique, Father God, and surrounding them with your love and protecting them and providing for them because you are their Lord, they shepherd that they shall not want. And I pray that the people in Mozambique will come to know Jesus Christ as their personal Lord and Savior, that you will send people outside of their country, Father God, to aid them and to give them supplies that you would do a miracle to help them to be able to get everything that they need, Father God, by moving things out the road or something, Father God, some kind of way, Father God. And thank you for drying up those waters so they can get by and do the things that they need and they don't have to be walking and be swimming in deep water and stuff, Father God. Thank you for drying up the deeps of waters, Father God, by your supernatural power and your anointing, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. And I pray, Father God, that you will send your angels to bind up the principalities in the nation of Africa, Father God, and in the cities of Mozambique, Father God, the principalities to defeat the principalities and evil forces and powers and rulers of darkness of this world and spiritual wickedness in high places that rise up against the people in the nation of Africa, that rise up against the people in Mozambique and all other cities surrounding Mozambique, Father God, that have been hard hit by this cyclone. In Jesus Christ's name, I thank you for bringing recovery and rejuvenation and rest and peace and serenity and contentment and joy. Father God, upon the people of Mozambique, even though they're in a very dire situation, Father God, and I thank you for bringing deliverance and salvation for the people in Mozambique, Father God, and delivering them out of all type of bondage and slavery and imprisonment, Father God. And I thank you for bringing finances upon them, Father God, and strong recovery for them, Father God, and for their land and properties and homes. Father God, that you are making a way out of no way to find a place for all the survivors to have a place, a safe place to lay their head, Father God. And I pray that you will heal the ones that have gotten injured by the storm, Father God, supernaturally by your power, that you will heal them physically, mentally, psychically, and um, emotionally, Father God from any trauma or any uh, wounds or injuries, Father God, or infirmities in Jesus Christ's name, Father God, and that you will heal their minds, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, from any anxiety or trauma, Father God, or despair, Father God, of oppression, that you will break all oppression off of the people of Mozambique by your power and your anointing in the blood of Jesus Christ, in Jesus Christ's name. And I ask, Father, that you will release the blood of Jesus Christ to deliver the people, Father God, out of the hand of the devil into the hand of Jesus Christ, Father God. That you release the blood of Jesus Christ to deliver the people in Mozambique, in Africa, Father God, in all surrounding cities where this storm has hit, cyclone has hit people in Africa, Father God. I pray that you, Heavenly Father God, will release the blood of Jesus Christ to break all poverty and lack and shortage and slavery and bondage and witchcraft and all evil attacks of sabotage off of their lives and off of their country. 
Father God, and all of their city and Mozambique and all the